Welcome to Clean Energy Compression Corporation's headquarters just outside of Vancouver, British Columbia. My name is Dave Orton. I'm the Senior Vice President of Global Business Development and Marketing. And with me is Tomas Yoja, Manager, Research and Development and Head of our Development Program on the Clean CNG Standard Compression Platform. Tomas, I know that um, Clean Energy Compression really focused on standardization of the product line. What was so important about standardization? Yeah, so the biggest uh, focus on standardization to cut down uh, lead time, um, reduce the number of inventory counts. The reason it's robust is because we have time to develop one product rather than using the time to developing 100 different types of products. During standardization, we focus to uh, have really uh, engineered subcomponents where we put it together and the quality is always the same the performance is the highest what we can get out from these uh, equipment and uh, the offering is really uh, what the customer wants uh, as soon as we have the uh, purchase order we can cut out all the engineering time because it's all pre-engineered and optimized for the highest level for any uh, considerations what we would like to uh, put into the design so with lower vibration, of course, comes significantly reduced noise, which is extremely important in this industry these days. Can you comment on that? Correct. One of the design features was to consider the residential requirement. Uh, CNG market moves closer and closer to urban environment, where the noise is one of the uh, biggest problem. With the newly developed um, enclosure, acoustical enclosure, we achieved really low level uh, noise uh, uh, emission, uh, less than 75 dB at 3 meter. And this is a standard package. It's not an extra acoustical add-on. It's not a, a huge uh, enclosure around the package, which makes it more difficult to install. It's the standard package, which includes uh, to the standard offering. So, Tamash, we're standing here now about three meters from a 250 horse five stage machine running full out on gravel, unanchored, and we can have a conversation at normal full volume levels. That's correct. What's your DB reading? Right now, it was 73.3 uh, dBA at three meters from the I mean, it's, it's really remarkable. We had uh, several industry executives here the other day, and they simply couldn't believe it. Uh, in fact, standing here, although perhaps the audience can't hear it, the loudest noise is the squealing from the pipes as it recirculates back through the test bay. So, Kamaj, this is the famous loony test, where uh, the only reason this housing is around here is to protect the uh, air being sucked through the fans from actually pulling the loony over. But the loony is sitting in here, the machine's running, we're literally sitting on top of it, and we can still carry a conversation. And, uh, famous loony, it's right there. Made in Canada. So, in this design we created this service pathway which actually serves multiple uh, functions. We located all the major service, uh, serviceable items very close to this service pathway. The inlet filter, the discharge filter, the mechanical control panel all the with all the solenoids, um, uh, the motor connections, the belt and the sheave. Uh, we have all the um, uh, isolation valves in one place inside. We have the two fans. Uh, with improved uh, airflow and cowling, with a very efficient heat exchanger behind. Um, here we do have uh, one major crane, which actually, as you can see, it's a hide away type, and we can pull it in front. And we can assemble with this frame, with this crane, actually. And now we created one major uh, crane. If we have any major uh, heavy component, we can just Put it outside. So Tamash, one last feature brought to us again from Field Experience by D is the QR code feature. So QR codes are those standard codes that everybody sees and you can get a QR code reader on your phone and we have QR codes mounted on the various elements within the machine 
and on the exterior of the machine where you simply snap the QR code and it takes your smartphone directly to the website where the manual or a video or an instructional uh, element is there for the technician. All he needs is his smartphone, the QR code, and he's fully connected.